Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. Today's video takes us to Berea, Ohio, where we encounter a sovereign citizen who gets pulled over for no visible license plate, has no driver's license, and probably doesn't have any insurance either, and she winds up paying a shit ton of, uh, court costs to boot after this incident. So let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Hey, stay in the car. You not see my lights? I was pulling up at home. Okay, but you were getting pulled over, so you gotta stop. I did stop. No, you didn't. You kept driving. You got your license on you? No, I don't. Okay, where is it? I don't, I don't, uh, I don't carry a license. Okay, do you have a license? No, I do not. Here you go, if you would like to see. I'm a private citizen. Okay. And I'm at home right now. What's your name? Asada L. I'm a private citizen. I don't carry a license. Okay. Well, you need to have a license in Ohio to drive a vehicle. Um, not as a private citizen. Where the hell did you get that bullshit from? Because, well, according to Ohio statutes, which statutes are laws, by the way, uh, so just go look in Black's Law Dictionary and you shall see, according to Ohio Revised Statutes, you have to have a driver's license if you're going to operate a motor vehicle on the public roadway system. So wherever you got that BS from, you need to cut it out. And I would argue the Tenth Amendment, but apparently... She ended up losing in court anyway, so she must be aware that her arguments are quite piss poor at best. Yeah, as, as any citizen. Oh well, I'm I'm a private national. Okay. And I'm at home now. That doesn't matter. Okay. You said your name was what? Dominique. Dominique. Got a social, any other identifier? I don't give out my social. Okay, we gotta give me your name and date of birth, okay? My name is Dominique. What's your last name, Dominique? My, name, my last name is Camel. And I don't give out my social and I don't give out my date of birth. Okay, well, you have to do that. I have to identify as the operator of the vehicle. I don't have to give you my, my, yes, you my birthday. No, yes, I do you do. Not. Yeah. No, I do not. If you don't identify yourself, you can get arrested for that, okay? Listen. I just told him. I just told him. Yeah, but I need your. I need your stuff. Can, can you just stop digging through the car, please, for me? I'm not. I'm not bothering you. I'm about to give you my. Uh... There you go. Open the trunk. These motherfuckers. They don't have shit to do out here. What? I'm not. I'm at home. Thirty-three. You start another and also buy a U.S. passport card. Charlie. Five he just seven. I ain't have nothing to do. Five. He just hide behind me for absolutely no reason because I didn't do anything well, illegal. The reason I stopped you is because you don't have a plate. That's visible. I do. Ha I have a plate. It's a it's not 30, visible. It's thirty day tag and it's okay. paper. That's fine. I couldn't see it. That's why I got stopped. Uh, it's got to be well, visible. What did I do that was wrong vehicle. for you to want to see it? Not have a visible plate. The, it, I didn't do anything. You, you didn't have a plate that I could see from the back of your vehicle. It's right up on you. Okay. It's, That's it's, why you got stopped. Did stop. you see it, though? No, so I still have it. Okay. Because you kept coming all the way back here, and you jumped out of your car, so I'm coming to talk to you. I, I was coming home because my kids are hungry. That's I, I get that. So I was on if my you, way if home. If you stopped when you should have, and you said that, stop then when I, I you probably could have had a conversation. I, I stopped when I should have. My kids were hungry. They were waiting on me to pull up with the food. Okay. And that's what I did. I'm literally not okay. even a minute from home. All right, so you don't have a license, is that correct? I do not, I do not okay. contract with license. That's a contract, and I do not go into contract with the state okay. of Ohio with the license. Hey, Smooth Brain, this is not a contract. It is the freaking law. If you don't want to participate in driving on the uh, public roadways by having a license, well, then you can uh, ride a bike or you can walk to your destination. But in order to drive in the st in Ohio, you have to have a uh, valid driver's license to do so. 
Otherwise, like I said, you can start pounding pavement and uh, get to your destination that way. That's fine. You, you need to have a license to drive in Ohio, though. I don't. That, that is what it is. Okay. Clearly, you don't agree with that, but it doesn't change the law. Okay. Right. I've, I'm, I have all my paperwork in order that I've already placed to Cuyahoga County, Lorain County, and everywhere okay. else saying about my license. Okay. So. All right. Uh, do you have a license in any state? No, I do not. Okay. All right. Well, you just need to sit tight for me here, and uh, I'll get get you going here in a few minutes. All right, Jerry. The vehicle is Paul 64512. Pulling over a mother with six kids on her way to bring them, them their food home. That nothing to do, like I said. Do you have a driver's license? I don't, I, I do not. Would you, would you guys like to answer these questions? Just curious. Okay, well, would you like to fill this out? This is the public service questionnaire, please. I would like you to fill that out for me. Wow, a public servant's questionnaire. Probably one of the dumbest documents that you'll ever encounter with these Sovtards. I mean, it's a bunch of loaded questions that go really nowhere. It is just basically a bunch of sovereign citizen word salad meant to confuse anybody who reads it to begin with. Or people like this woman who fell for the uh, Sovtard garbage hook line and sinker i mean it is freaking ridiculous and i'll leave a link in the description box below for this particular document so you guys can laugh at it and this is and this is my fee schedule as well for you pulling me over for every minute that i've been this is a fee schedule that i have okay this is my this is me notice of intent fee schedule okay and, and this is for you to fill out, please. Okay, here's a spec for you. No, this is for you. That's all right. Or you, Ah, uh, yes, it wouldn't be a soft tart in this. It was a fee schedule as well. I mean, how much are you going to be charging per hour? Uh, twenty, fifty, sixty thousand dollars per hour? I mean, I've heard of higher. I mean, I heard one soft tart say a million dollars an hour. Uh, yeah. Good luck in getting any of that money, dude. A little longer than a few minutes later. Alright. <laughs> Should I just write refused right off? Second heard the passport card fell into the abyss. Are you serious? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Why don't you sign a question here? Uh, no. Okay, Dominique. Okay, obviously we're going to have some disagreements. I'm not going to try to convince you, and you're probably not going to convince me otherwise, right? Uh, but I do have to issue a citation for driving without a license and having a suspended license, okay? Here's this back for you. I don't have a suspended license because I don't have one. Okay, well, you used to have an ID card now. I don't have an ID card. Uh, there's one registered to you. Well, I don't have one. Same thing with the registration of your car that comes back to you. Okay. Okay. Um, all right, so like I said, you have the uh, suspensions and no license. Uh, you have a court date of October 28th. Okay, do you have insurance for the vehicle? Do you have an insurance policy or a card or anything like that? Yeah, I do. Okay, do you have it with you that I can see that I can mark I'm that you sure have it? I'm somewhere, but I don't, I'm not going okay. to search for it. All right, Britt, we'll bring it with you then. I'm not coming. Okay, well, if you don't come, you get a bench warrant for your arrest, all right? Uh, that's just fair warning. All right. right. Uh, do you have a phone number handy? No, I do not. Okay, and uh, the last thing I need is a signature from you. It's not acknowledging I'm guilt or saying that I explained it to you. Okay, just going to write refuse. These people ain't got shit okay. to do. Listen, I'm just writing refused, okay, and that's just how it's going to go into the court. All right, everything's on body cam, everything's recorded, okay, that's but I, I need I you. I told you, I don't I, I got you. with the state of Ohio hey, I'm, I'm for not yelling a driver's at you. license. I'm not yelling at you yeah, either, but I'm going to agree. You pulled me over for no reason. You had well, nothing okay. to do. You were in a whole I explained other the reasons. lane going another way. I had to. I explained the reason. You ain't. Okay. You pulled me over for no reason. Driving while black. Oh, come on now. Did you have to actually bring 
race into this as well because, well, this is more about the law than anything else. I mean, you just pretty much stated that the laws don't apply to you earlier. So it's not about the color of your skin, dumbass. It's about you having the ability to understand the laws to begin with. And, uh, well, that is very questionable that you can understand anything with all that soft, hard garbage running through your head. Okay. <laughs> Alright. Uh, so I'm, I'm going to get you your copy and then we'll get out of each other's hair, okay? Here you go, miss. You can just set it down to the right. Okay. It's on the top of your car. Put a windshield. It's right there for you. Well, despite all this BS and her saying that she wasn't going to go to court, guess what? She ends up going to court and, uh, she is charged with driving with a suspended license, among other things, and she winds up in uh, paying eight hundred dollars, and that's including court costs. So, lady, uh, this soft hard, this uh, way of life that you decided to adopt, well, you might want to think about how much it's going to cost you in the end, because this could be a common occurrence with you. In fact, from what I understand, it has become quite a common occurrence with you. Apparently, you didn't learn your lesson. At any rate, uh, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one. Dude, so there's no way I can get in, bro? Come on, I'll put you on my YouTube. But shut up, Wesley. You gotta put signs up, ma'am, if it's- Are you Glenn Serio? Who's that?